Greetings, Executor. Though we all grieve for the loss of mighty Tassadar, we must find the resolve to carry on. He sacrificed himself to destroy the Overmind, but many Zergs still rage across our ruined homeworld. Without the Conclave to lead us, or the protection of our great fleets, it seems we must fend for ourselves. Eldaris is correct, Executor. As we have both seen, the Zerg will not halt their rampage until every last one of us is dead. I suggest that we retreat to our last functional warp gate, and travel to where the Zerg cannot follow us. With all due respect, Zeratul, the Protoss do not run from their enemies. Ire is our homeworld. It is here that we shall make our stand. Just as your conclave did. They are dead now, Eldaris. Dead because they allowed their pride to blind their reason. Only if we learn from their mistakes can we live to avenge them. Now, Executor, I know of a place where we can find solace. It is Shakuras, the secret homeworld of my people, the Dark Templar. Your people? We would be seen as tyrants to them. Why would they shelter us? Have I not pledged myself to your cause? Not all beings are as unforgiving as your lamented conclave, Eldaris. You are right, of course. Executor, Zeratul shall find us passage to the warp gate. After the gate has been secured, Phoenix and the new Praetor Artanis shall lead our surviving brethren to Shakuras. Executor, I am Artanis. Though I have only recently been appointed Praetor, you can trust that I will uphold the honor and traditions of the Templar. We shall see. Hey boys, mind if we tag along? I figure you're heading anywhere has got to be better than staying here with the Zerg. Commander Raynor, as ever, your assistance is appreciated. We would be honored if you joined us.
It is good to see more of our brethren on the battlefield. Evacuate the Kamai survivors before the Zerg return. Just worry about getting your people through the gate. Phoenix and I will hang back and protect our flank until everyone is through. <laughs> 